morning everybody. Good morning. Oh. Wow. Oh, I can see. Got a bit of a beast of a spot growing there. Yeah. We've got an extra passenger. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, kids. Sparkly. Oh, she got sparkly pen. Craig and I are doing our usual posh and becks, and we're in the same outfit. Oh, yeah. Where's your cap? I know, and he could do with a cap because this is getting a little bit out of hand. This here. Anyway, flat uh, cap because the 28 degrees is disappearing. Yeah, look at the weather now. Never mind. So plans have changed once again. That's unusual. Strange for us, I know. We are going to a little town called Cassel, which is K-A-S-S-E-L, instead of Hanover. Hanover, because we want some nice little medieval fairy princess towns, and this place has been recommended to us. So we just saw it on a Facebook sorry. post from yeah. Harbin Globetrotter. Yeah, thank you to those guys. Oh, to sorry, I'm bouncing all over the place here. Yeah, it's ready. Get in the right gear. You're in the wrong gear. Uh -huh. You are, you're bouncing all over it. <clears throat> anyway. <laughs> so, yeah, we're off. Gonna take us a few hours to get there because we are traffic calmers, aren't we, in this motorhome? Yeah. Home. yeah. And it's wet and we don't really want to be pushing it a bit too much in the motorhome in the rain. So, off we go. See if we can go and find some Hansel and Gretel towns. Yeah, a nice little dry area where there's no clouds around, so we can take the dog for a walk. Yeah. Box strapped in. So, yep, yeah, off we go. Speak to you soon. So, we're here at the new park up in. Well, we don't even know Cas how to pronounce Castle. Castle, Castle, Castle. But check the house out behind us. Proper old German style house now. Um, so, we're going to go now over the bridge uh, into the town we were driving through it on the map looks like this little speck doesn't it's it like, it's like it's I, quite little, the yeah ones, yeah um, we've got it and it's just not well it's probably the size of nottingham and more mm. <laughs> yeah so huge um so oh, a nice big river as well hey i can't see okay say hello lisa hello all right so this is the river into the town, well, the oh, yeah. city I would say, because it's absolutely huge. So we're going to have a look around. First impressions, looks really nice. Wow, look at this, yeah. So first impressions, looks really, really nice. Um, it is massive, so we've got no chance of doing all this. So we're going to pick a couple of places um, and have a walk around. To the orangery. Ah. Right, eh? the big so they either grow orange, grow oranges, or it's all supporting of the Netherlands. Here we go. I don't think you can see the pickaxe. Yeah, you can see the pickaxe on the river bank there. Yeah. So we'll probably investigate there. It's the Can't do that. Oh, can't you? No. I've done it before. No, you haven't. <laughs> no. <laughs> so uh, we're going to have an investigate anyway. Yeah, you can press that button, it turns it off. <laughs> oh, so there's the pickaxe. And there, through the trees, okay. is the orangery. Which apparently is where they used to grow uh, oranges indoors. Lots. Oh, that's their assumption. I thought you were giving me some actual geeky facts then. Uh, <laughs> so there's lots of statues on it anyway. Have a look. So we've just looked it up on Google and it was a geeky guess from the geek. She got it right. What did they used to do, babe? Grow oranges, yeah. Grow oranges inside. Yeah. Um, put your thoughts in the comments, please. Am I a geek or not? <laughs> one for one. <laughs> She's a gorgeous geek. Anyway, some amazing statues on there. Maybe the people who planted the trees. Okay, it hasn't got one there. Massive place. Huge grounds. No, 
Hello. Statues all the way around. Okay. All the way around there, yeah, finger. We have a drink here as well. There's all the statues upon it. Come on, Dad. I'm coming, darling. Have a look what we're in here. Ooh, what? Oh, my word. Wow. Hello. Oh, the detail on these is incredible. There they are through there. How are you, sir? We found a maze behind the bushes. It's the easiest maze in the world. There's one of these either side of the orangery. Twist. I don't know, maybe that's a sundial or a, a well in the middle. No. It's done on the wiser. So I've just done a quick bit of research on the on the building behind here. This is the orangery and it's actually a um, planetarium and um, astronomical centre of Hesse. So the building was built in the 18th century and according to the French style. And um, it's the beginning of these Baroque gardens, which you can just see over my shoulder there. All of these um, trees, which you can see are actually planted in perfect symmetry with one another. So we're going to have a little wander down and see what it's like. There's geese over there, so we need to just be careful of the dog, because she is just a little bit crazy because we've been travelling quite a bit today. And she's been cooped up, so we're going to have a little wander down, see what it's all like. It looks absolutely gorgeous, and I would imagine in the summer, it's absolutely beautiful. And there's the view of it from a distance. There's the water. And James is over there looking to see who these statues are. I think they might be Roman gods because we've just gone past Venus and they're uh, back to Venus. So he's going to have a look see what that is and see what these gods are. They're not Greek ones. He thinks they're Roman ones because of Venus. And because this is, as Liz probably just said, a planetarium. And, um, uh, what's it called? What's it? Astronomical. Astronomical. Yeah, I remember the word. Too long for me, not really. Ah, so now it becomes clear the platform back there in the world's simplest maze uh, would have had a statue on it, and it no longer has. Oh, like a plinth. Yeah, a, yeah, a plinth that's the word. So maybe they were, they were denounced or something. So that's Vulcan. That's Flora. Not as good as butter, but there's flora. Oh, there are other butters available, yeah. And there's Hades. Get back a picture of him. E Ryan, or Irene. I don't know if I've actually heard of that one. So let's see if James has got any information. So we're getting a little bit confused because, yeah, there's some Greek. There's some Roman, yeah, but they're all written in German. <laughs> they're all written in German, which is, which is confusing me. Yeah, yeah. so you're trying to work out what planets are, aren't you? Yeah, because at the start I was confused with Venus. No, I, I completely oh, what happened? With Venus, I completely forgot how Venus is Aphrodite in Greek mythology, and Roman mythology, right, and the thing is, there's Hades, and Hades is god of the underworld in. Greek mythology, 
but then there's also other gods that look like it from Roman mythology. It could just be that yeah, all of them are Greek, but they're just written in German. It's just because of how, um, like, with if I look at like the names for each of the Greek mythology gods, they're all in English. Yeah. And so maybe that's why I'm confused with it. All right. Yeah, who knows? What is fails the list is mom and dad, who are the gods that the motor home. Isn't that right? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so we're just wondering how big this park is because if you look behind me, let's walk and we've still got all that walk to go. Um, let's have a look on Leslie's phone just how big this park is in this tiny little thing, place that we thought it was, uh, it was cattle. So that's where tiny. we are at the moment. Just here, obviously. Just here. Oops. You can hear Lisa there, having a, uh, having a tantrum. Okay. But yeah, how big it is, it's huge. Found another heron or a crane. Uh, yes, it is a real one. Lisa, it's a real one, not a statue down him. Mommy saw Dad. The heron again. There you go. Dad! More beautiful areas of the park. It's all been kept pristine as well. The same way, if this was National Trust back home, well, if this was back home in the UK, this would be National Trust, wouldn't mm -hmm. it? Probably. And it cost you probably 16, 17 pounds each just to walk around something this, like this and kept this well. Mm -hmm. It is, yeah. Um, check this out for a sports centre. How cool is that? Just slide through there as well. Indoor swimming slide. Oh, yeah. <laughs> wow, that's amazing. Oh, to be a PT here. I can see. Just a tad. I'm imagine the summer. I want to go on it. Here's the other side of the, the pool. Oh, I can't zoom in, can I? Okay, you told me I can't zoom in anymore. Ah, I can. I can. You see, you can zoom in. <laughs> is that what I was trying to say? Well <laughs> anyway. Well done, Mum. Well done, Mother. I think you've seen the sides for long enough now, haven't you? Maybe you're not a geek after all. <laughs> well, hello, everybody. I'm not even sure if I said good morning or what. It's afternoon at the moment. Um, look where we are. Set that beauty edge. So, this is the Hercules monument. There's his bear bum there. Maybe we'll stay this side. Um, and there's, there's a castle and a Hercules monument really high up. And believe me, the motor, motorhome knew we were really high up and going up a really big hill. It fell, it. I think we used a quarter of a tank of petrol just going up the hill in second gear. Um, but we're going to go and have a look around it. We're going to have a look around here anyway. There's loads of motorhomes parked here. We're not sure whether we can stay overnight, but we'll see. I mean, have a look at this, it's beautiful. Yeah, there's a few steps there, right? 
And there's Hercules. Better be with bum. Let's have a look in the middle. Try not to drop the phone, eh? If I drop the phone in there, I'm not going after it. Literally 360 degree views on the top of there. So as ever, mm. James is the font of a fair bit of knowledge. Yeah. <laughs> On Greek mythology and Roman mythology, tell, tell us a bit about this one, mate. So this is definitely Roman mythology because with Greek mythologies, it, the name for Hercules is Heracles, and it's because the mother of Heracles wanted him to be named after Hera because apparently Hera hated Her Heracles because of how it was another what's the word for concubine I think something like that okay. for, um, that Zeus cheated on her with okay. and this place is really old as well because in one of the boards it shows that well, it's saying that this place was made in 1696 mm -hmm. and that's mostly the reason why there's renovations all the way down there and so is this part of Germany or not no well because I was made in 1696, it wouldn't have been part of Germany. It would have most likely be, been part of the Prussian Empire. Okay. Or another small Baltic state. Okay. And I think it's Baltic anyway, it might be wrong. And yeah, that's it really. All right. So lots of information here for you. We'll go around and have a look at the view from the other side now. You can see. How far they could have seen from here. Oh, wow. wow, look at that yellow crane. Oh, sorry, look at that big, <laughs> yeah, big slosh, that castle down there. Yeah. There you go. Oh, and there, yeah. There's the one down there. Where's the uh, orange amazing or something? I don't know what it's called. I can't say it properly. Orangery. 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 This orangery. Maybe it's on the other side. Yeah, it's an amazing vantage point here. Look at this, though. Yeah. This Hercules must have been the god or something. Have all this. What was he, a demigod? Yeah. Or a real god? He was a demigod, and after he died, he was turned into a god. What was that, mate? He was a demigod when he was born. Yeah. But when he was killed, he returned it, and the gods made him into a god. Okay, then. I wonder who that was, though. Be like your mum, yeah? Goddess. <laughs> Always got to creep over. We've got to keep on the right side. Shh. Oh, wow. And he said he was a demon. Yeah. And there's the demon. <laughs> We've got an amazing view here, but look at this behind us now. Unless it was magnificent then. Flip in there. Wow, I just thought this, that was impressive. Check this out. So isn't he thinking that's uh, Hercules in his costume? But no. No. What is it, Jane? Who is it? Uh, I think it's Pan. Uh, Who? Pan, god of nature. Okay. I think he's god of nature. And um, so he has horns on him, and because he was a satyr, the first ever satyr. And no, normally, and with satyrs, they are half goat, half human. And then on the right, I'm pretty sure that's Thanatos. Okay. Or it, it's Thanatos or Cronus. And they could, probably not Cronus. Because it's a sand type thing in his right hand. And he is known for being the Lord of Time. And his, like, and his weapon that he had was a scythe, 
Oh yeah, yeah, so it's five, five definitely, yeah, yeah. And under that, I have no idea. <laughs> Who's no idea? What was no idea they got up? <laughs> so this is this in its full magnificence. Look at that. Shame about the scaffolding and the cranes, but they don't really detract from how incredible this place is. And we've still got to walk down to this bloody castle and then back up to the motorhome. So this is a monument to Hercules. And this is in a place called Castle, which is K A S S E L. Got some goldfish in there as well. So we're just walking down from Hercules uh, Monument to the Schloss, 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 the castle. Um, it's a gorgeous scenery, isn't it? What do you think of it? I see, and I can't. Um, get down because my legs are tired already. Got to go up yet. <laughs> We're not even halfway down. We've got to go back up. Some beautiful scenery. You can hear a waterfall around the corner. You can see a bridge as well. Oh, we'll go down and have a look at that in a minute. That's where it's coming from. Yeah, actually, on Hercules Mountain, there's water in there, and they released water all the way down the middle of the uh, ma uh, monument that we've seen all the way down the hill. So we'll lead down here. Look at that. Here's the waterfall. Imagine how what of a raging torrent that could become. Getting closer to the bottom. And yet more stunning waterfalls and scenery. It's stunning. Trouble is, we've just found out castles up there behind them trees. So we're just so saying the how hill. good value this is. So, what is it, Ben? Yeah, so it's six euros each for me and Craig, but the kits were free, under 18s get in for free. But the six euros is only to go into the castle and go up to the Hercules Tower, otherwise, it's completely free. It's huge, isn't it? Yeah, it is massive. Massive, massive area. Um, and those two things close at five o'clock, but the grounds are open until probably, well, 24 hours, I think it said on the... Yeah. Well, we can park until website. 11 o'clock on the uh, car park. Yeah, so, so we'll, on, we'll leave Only because it's charged till 11, yeah. We'll leave the um, website address in the comments for it, because if you are in this area, we'd definitely recommend coming. It's absolutely beautiful. Yeah. Glad we never came a couple of days ago and it was boiling <laughs> yeah. hot. I mean, we didn't oh, get here till, what was it, about two or two, two, about two o'clock? Really yeah, if we'd have come like here early morning, morning we'd, have, no. we'd have easily spent all day here, easily. No. Yeah. Uh, took our time a bit more. Yeah, we all kind of racing around, aren't we? Yeah. But, you know, we do stay tonight, we can always walk around again in the morning. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. But we're not driving back up that hill again. No. <laughs> so we're, we're on the way to the castle. Yeah, we think. We hope. Yeah. If you don't see a view of the castle, it's because we didn't make it. Oh, we found something. We don't actually know if it is a castle now. I think it looks like a castle, but this was pointing towards Lovenberg, wasn't it? Yeah. Lovenberg. With Schloch, Schloch the down below. Well, this looks more like a castle than, than the big house at the bottom. Either way, we've made it. Yeah. Kids are more excited because they found a cafe. <laughs> Amazing. So we made it to the top. The top. No, we made it to the and bottom. The, and the back down. And then back halfway up to the 
Or the Gingsman. Yeah. I mean, it looks all right, doesn't it? I mean, I don't know all the fusses. <laughs> How good is that? I mean, the, the, the grounds alone is just incredible. What's it called again? It's not just Hercules Monument, is it? No, but you know what? I could not even tell you what it's called. Like I say, we'll put the comment, put it in the, in the uh, description. Well, of the, video. the name is just there <laughs> right now. <laughs> and about that, I'm magic. <laughs> That's it. Wipe off. Wipe off. There you <laughs> go. It. Kids got their coke. No, 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 we've got their coke. Kids got the beer. Wait. <laughs> That's it. Alright, so we've done Hercules Monument. We've done. That must be the schloss mm, Yeah, the sloshed at the bottom. And now we're getting sloshed at the top. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're not even close to the top though, this is the problem. Which I think <laughs> pronounced Leuvenberg. Uh, so, um, but as you've seen before, I've been wrong uh, many a time. You finally admitted it. Once? <laughs> you finally admitted it. I've got, I've got a, a sort of a thing on Facebook that I'm going to put. I'm going to put it in. Post on the page. Oh, run it, so I'm done it. Sorry. If you know, you know. No, 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 no. Do not put if you know, you know. You don't know, you no. don't know. Do not put if you know, you know. Because you know what that is, don't you? Well. That's when people put the pineapples upside down in the motels. <laughs> what? Unless we've got no not problem with swingers. <laughs> we've got kids. What do you mean by that? Uh... So, unless you want to swap the kids as well, that's a whole different story. Yes, stop, no, put the video there anyway, look at the castle. So, let's go and have a look inside this. Uh, well, this actually, is this is Lovenberg, Lo Lo Lion's Mountain. Have a look inside. The yeah, the Schloss is a huge place at the bottom. This is Loven, I think it's pronounced Lovenberg, which is Lion's Mountain. Wow. They're amazing. Whoever's mountain it is, it's amazing. Ah, yeah, there you go. There's the Lion's, Lion's Mountain. Okay, so we just went to in the castle, and apparently it's guided tour only. And the last tour went at four o'clock while we were drinking beer. <laughs> so now I don't know what time it is. Half four. All right, well, that's all right. Because uh, it was only six euros, so if you want to come to, we've just been told actually uh, by the guy in the bar, and I was speaking German to him, and I had to apologise because I said my German wasn't very good, and he said it was very good. So I was very pleased. I was very pleased by that. But there's so much I couldn't understand, so I just spoke to him in English on some of it. And it was like he said, tomorrow is the water games. So there's thousands of litres of water uh, coming down from Hercules Column at the top. Um, yeah, Hercules Column at the top, thousands of litres. And they're going to be coming all the way down the centre to the castle. So tomorrow, we're going to come back here and ask him. Amazing from this side. Subject to change. Oh, look. We've even been serenaded. Uh, yes, yeah, subject to change. <laughs> but the plan is to come here tomorrow and watch the water games. Here they come. Well done, Issa. Oh, did we beat you? Are you shattered? <laughs> well done, darling. Well done, Leslie. Come on, he said you nearly done it. What? We came, we saw, where's Issa? Mom. We conquered. Emma, All of that. Here's Leslie. Here's Leslie. We made it. We went to proper PT then. Yeah, was him. There was a lady coming up the hill and she's absolutely done it. And I was like, come on. <laughs> she didn't understand what she said, obviously. Well, she, I think she, Got yeah, the gist got the gist of, you know, got the, gist of the boot up back the side. Like, <laughs> well done. Okay, okay. We've done that walk. So well done, everybody. I need a drink. <laughs> well done, James. Even the, even the dog was. Pause her. Oh, I'm gone, I'm gone, I'm gone. I had to drag her. <laughs> right, we'll see you back at the motorhome this time, definitely. <laughs> so this is where we're stopping. We've got one car here with us. They just turned up and they're taking the kids out for a walk through the forest. So we're going to stop in the forest tonight. It is next to a main road. Um, but I would have thought kind of half past 10, 11 o'clock, there's not going to be many cars coming up and down this main road. And there's a, 
I don't know how to describe it, a babbling brook <laughs> uh, just behind us as well. So there are the sounds of that for the night, which would be lovely. So we'll, uh, unless, in, unless anything happens, we'll see you all in the morning. And then we're going to go to the castle and the Wasser games, the water games. I don't know how to say games in German, so water games. Good morning, everybody. Morning. Welcome to the views of Van Lyfer. Of a wild hair day. And the hair day of Van Lyfer. Do you know what, actually? Since we started Van Lyfer, what? Just over two months ago, I think I bobbled about my hair three times, which is, ex I usually do it three times a day. So. Mine's just like cancer floss. <laughs> the views we've got this morning to wake up to. So, not bad at all. The and the barking dog. Time. Yeah. So, we're going to be here today and hopefully, um, shorter than it, but hopefully, well not hopefully, but definitely, uh, just there, all the way down the centre, there's going to be thousands of litres of water going down. Uh, so, we're going to enjoy the day here, and then we're going to find somewhere else to stay tomorrow night, just heading towards Berlin. Uh, we're not going all the way to Berlin, but we're heading towards Berlin, aren't we? Yep. We're not doing the big walks we did yesterday, are we? Well, I don't know. I don't know. Okay then. It would be quite nice to go on this rush at the bottom. Yeah. Have a look. Uh, okay. So, we may or may not see the bottom. Okay, so we said we wouldn't be doing these steps again. <laughs> we lied. <laughs> we loved them so much yesterday. God knows how many there were. It must be over. Probably over 500. Probably over six, 700. But uh, we lied. We'd love to do them again. Yeah, to be fair, we haven't got the dog today, so it's a lot easier. The dog's back at the motorhome with James, who's getting around Sunday, but he wants to go with some schoolwork, so he's got some days off next week, and he's going to call a couple of friends. So here we've got Issa, who absolutely hates getting a photograph taken of when she was in school, school set and would refuse to get a photo taken, requesting a photo shoot <laughs> on the castle steps. <laughs> I've got a question for Leslie. Why are we doing up and down these steps and all around these grounds again? And in, and in the hot sun? I don't know. No. <laughs> no, we, we are trying to get fit, aren't we? We? Yes. Yes, we are trying to get fit. We're married now, so what's mine is mine, and yeah. yours is mine as well. So that's it. Yeah, you might have belly. Yeah. <laughs> so we are going to get fit. Yeah. It, you know, fitter than what we are already. Cause, yeah, we're not unfit. Fit, is yeah. It? When you live in the major homes, you come to realise that it's quite physical and yeah. things that you've got to do. So you don't want to be absolutely ruined when you're doing trying to do it. Mm -hmm. Plus, you know, we've got to try and set a good example for the kids, and we want longevity, don't we? We don't yeah. want to just be doing this for short amount of time and yeah. um, since we left the house I haven't done any kind of physical activity. When you consider Leslie's a personal trainer with a, an online business, you yeah, know, then it's different now because you don't do all the lifting and stuff no, like four or five like, times clients a day. No, you lifting constantly when I was in my little gym and since we've left the house I haven't done any lifting at all apart from our um, mattress topper which is pretty heavy <laughs> but that's it it really isn't it yeah. not in comparison to doing deadlifts and things like that like i was always yeah. doing so you've got to think about things in a different way now and that's you've it. got like a really limited amount of equipment because the weight and the space in the motorhome is um, probably not the best idea to be doing this go down yeah. <laughs> yeah we've we've got limited weight and space in the motorhome now so yeah. i've only got two five kilogram dumbbells and a 10 kilogram kettlebell You've got your uh, TRXs, haven't you? Got my TRX and my boxing gloves, but you know, then you can do lots of things with those pieces of equipment, but things like this going up and down stairs is just so good for your cardio. Yeah, and obviously, Leslie's taking on personal training, some you know, clients for a personal training business, so she wants to make sure she's kind of fit. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, yeah you've got to lead by example. Physically and, and mentally. Yeah, because I do suffer with anxiety, so. When I'm exercising and eating well, I'm not drinking booze. Yeah. That's a big, big impact on me, doesn't it? That's it. Not that I'm saying I'm going to completely knock the booze on the head, but not as yeah. much as we've been doing. That's it. All right, so that's why we're doing it. We're going to enjoy okay. it. Though. So we're not going around the castle. 
because um, we have to book in online. They didn't tell us that either. He said we can get us, you can get, you can get us in at three o'clock, uh, but we're actually going to be doing something else at three o'clock. So we've decided not to do that. Um, we're going to get the princess a lolly ice or ice lolly, depending on where you're from. Ice lolly. Um, and uh, well, breakfast, beers, and no. I'll be no, of course not, no beers. Oh, we're gonna get a bowl we're gonna get a bowl <laughs> of lettuce and some water so we've made it back to the bottom of the yeah, castle so we, which i suppose is about half up the bloody hill ready for just with about two minutes to go ready for the water to come down so what we're gonna do now place ourselves here and have a look it better be bloody impressive there's some bloody trickle of water coming down let's hope it's a gush a gush of water come flying down let's have a look here comes the water. Fountains are getting bigger at the top there. Waterfalls are getting bigger. Filling the pools up at the top. So the floats go over the top of that second one. The pools at the top that we would have seen when we had the video yesterday. So the dog was drinking. Uh, coming down the sides. Okay, so if you want to settle in for uh, some dinner, <laughs> look, look for some coffee, got, got the roast dinner, and then we'll come back. steps so far. Yeah. Isa, I know I can count that way. Isa, do you want to come here again? No! No. No. So, we'll be somewhere else tomorrow. I want to see now. 646, I think. Or did lose count at 450. And I lost count at 500 and something. Uh, no, I'm pretty sure it's 646. But I reckon it was probably more like 666. I reckon there was 666 steps there. Anyway, she's moaning all the way, and all she's got is a sweet. It's James. Well, home. we made it back. She's rocking the beach. Yeah. Um, so, um, <laughs> <laughs> um, we're going to start heading to the next place now. And uh, so, well done on you did 646 steps with us yesterday on the way down, and then on the way back up. And you've done 646 six steps down today and on the way back up. And you went all the way down the hill to the big house. So well done, you lot. Um, I hope you're as knackered as we are. Hey, what was it, did you say today? We did three miles, three and a half miles, was it? Yeah. Three and a half mile from the top to the bottom. So thanks for watching as the kids are about to burst in. Thanks for watching. Thanks for liking and commenting. If you haven't, please help us out. Like, watch, comment subscribe all that kind of stuff um so thanks very much and uh, we'll see you soon <laughs>